Golden Retrievers are one of the most popular dogs in America. That being said, you might have some questions regarding your specific situation. For example, what if you work long hours? Can a Golden Retriever be left alone for a long time? Yes. Golden Retrievers actually do find left alone if you take the proper precautions. For example, your dog will need a bathroom break every 3 to 5 hours. Also, your dog should have access to water throughout the day even if they are inside. Will your Golden Retriever get lonely? Leaving your Golden Retriever home alone takes some special consideration. Hopefully, you are considering this before you brought your puppy home. If you already have a dog, then you may need to act quickly to make the long day more pleasant for your golden buddy. Before I move on with the video, I want to ask you a simple question. Do you want to train your dog for any basic commands like sit and stay? Do you want to stop any of the behavioral problems of your dog like pooping inside the house, biting, jumping, or barking? If your answer is yes, Please grab the free dog training secrets guide in which I have disclosed the deepest dog training secrets that professional dog trainers don't want you to know about. These training secrets would help you have a well-behaved, super intelligent, smart and obedient dog without spending hours in training him or her. The secret training technique ebook is available for free only for a limited time. So go and grab it before it's too late. Link to the free ebook and training videos is in the description below. What about anxiety-based behaviors in dogs left alone? When we discuss destructive behavior in a dog that is left alone, we need to differentiate between boredom-based destruction and anxiety-based destruction. If your dog turns the house into a demolition zone while you are gone, then you need to consider a few questions. Does my golden display signs of anxiety as I am leaving the house, or when he thinks I am leaving? Look for trembling, hiding, uncontrollable bowels, pacing, or tail tucking. Some dogs act normal when you are getting ready to leave for the day, and then progressively gets worse throughout the day. This kind of behavior suggests that the dog is just experiencing boredom rather than anxiety. Crates are no place to spend all day long. One of the solutions that some golden owners turn to is the crate. If you are going to be gone for a long, extended day, then a crate is not the solution. Your dog loves sitting in his crate, if you have crate trained him correctly. For him, his crate is like your favorite chair or spot on the sectional. Dogs have to go to the bathroom regularly. If you leave a golden retriever in a crate for too long, he will eventually go to the bathroom. Not only does this leave you with a mess to clean up, but you are now messing with the dog's subconscious that has taught the dog to keep his face clean. In addition to the tidiness issues, you can also introduce serious health concerns by leaving your dog in a crate all day. Retrievers are already susceptible to hip and elbow dysplasia. Although this disease is genetic, there are some studies that show the disorder can be developed in other ways. What causes hip dysplasia in dogs? The first likely culprit is bad genes. There are, however, environmental factors that can increase the probability that a dog gets hip or elbow dysplasia including insufficient exercise, obesity, and poor nutrition. How long is too long to leave a golden retriever? 1. Is your dog going to have room to roam? If your dog can get up and wander around without a problem and even run a bit, then your golden can stay home for a while. What if your dog is going to be confined to his properly sized crate? Well, you can't leave him in there for more than 2 or 3 hours every now and then. If a crate is your only option, then you should not leave your golden retriever alone while you are at work. 2. What about potty breaks while you are gone? If your dog can get to an appropriate bathroom place completely on his own, then this will not be a limiting factor. On the other hand, if your dog requires you to let him out or back in, then you cannot leave him alone as long. You, or someone else, will have to visit your dog at least every 4 to 5 hours depending on his age. Puppies will have to get out even more often than that. 3. What will your golden retriever do for fun while he is alone? There are several different scenarios that might keep your dog mentally stimulated throughout the day. For example, take a Kong toy and fill it with water-soaked dog food. Then hang it from a string. The more of these kinds of things you have around your house, the longer your retriever will be okay on his own. 4. Can your dog take care of his thirst on his own? Water is incredibly important for your dog's overall health and basic body functions. 
Unlike food where you can limit how often your dog eats to once or twice a day for older golden retrievers, your dog should have access throughout the day. Especially in the summer. This should be pretty easy. If you need to, just buy an extra water bowl and make sure that they are both filled when you leave. 5. Will your dog be able to handle a sudden change in temperature or weather on his own? I know that the weatherman where you live is probably never wrong. Where I live, however, it seems like I have a better chance in Vegas than the weatherman getting the weather right on any given day. As you take a look at your golden situation, what will he do if it turns cold? What if it starts raining? Does your dog have a place to go to get out of these unforeseen turns in temperatures? Your dog needs an insulated dog house or a doggy door into your garage. That way, if the weather takes a turn for the worse while your dog is alone, you don't have to rush home. Do you want to have a well-behaved, obedient and calm pet dog without spending hours in training him? Check out the first link in the description and download the secret training technique guide absolutely free. It is available for free only for a limited period of time. Thanks for watching the video. Comment below if you liked the video. Please subscribe to the channel Little Paws Training if you are serious about training and grooming your dog. Also, join our Facebook group where you get all the solutions to your daily doggy problems.